Yo, what's going on guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to show you how to make this outfit. So as you can see, it does have the black joggers and the black duffel bag, uh, which I'll be showing you how to get both of them in this video. Anyway, before we get into the video, if you are new here, please go down below and subscribe. We're trying to get to 90,000 subscribers, and I believe we're about 700 away. Also, if you do go on to enjoy, or if you find this video helpful, uh, please leave a like down below, as we're trying to aim for 800 likes on this video, and it will help out a lot. Anyway, shout out to these people on screen now for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. Also, if you guys are in need of money in GTA 5, be sure to check out Digizani as they do offer cheap, fast and reliable cash and rank services. So if you want this, check out the link in the description and don't forget to use my code TJRH for 5% off your order. And without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Now, for this outfit, we will of course be needing the black joggers, uh, which I'll be showing you how to get right now. And afterwards, I'll show you how to make the outfit. So for the black joggers, you will need an MOC, and you want to go inside of your MOC. And then once you're in here, you want to go to the back of the MOC, and there should be a computer screen. Now from here, go onto this computer screen, and you want to scroll down to the mission called Work Dispute, and start this one up. Now if you do not have it unlocked, you will have to do the ones uh, before this. And then hit confirm to start up the mission. And then once you load into this menu, set the difficulty to easy, and then invite anyone and start this up. And then once you spawn in, you want to exit a plane. And you will need to know what one of your apartments is from here, as you want to go to one of your apartments, and they will not show up on the map. And from here, go into the blue circle, and then place a sticky bomb, and blow yourself up. And then once you spawn in, it should let you inside of your apartment. So you want to go into your apartment, and go to the wardrobe. And once you're in the wardrobe, save this outfit. And after you've saved it, quit a job using your phone. And then once you spawn in, you should be able to equip the outfit you just saved using your interaction menu. And it will have the black joggers, so if you want to make it just the black joggers, go to a clothing store and remove the top and shoes. Anyway, that's how you get a black joggers, now let's make the outfit. So to make this outfit, come to a clothing store, and make sure you have your black joggers equipped. And go to shoes. Then on shoes, equip any shoes you want to. Uh, it doesn't really matter. And after you equip your shoes, go over to gloves. And on gloves, equip any gloves you want to. I'm going to be going for the black woolen gloves. However, after you do this, you want to go onto tops. And then on tops, go down to work shirts. And for this outfit, we're going to be equipping the black double shirt open. So make sure you equip this one. Yeah, so equip this one. Then after you equip this, you want to back out and go up to designer t-shirts. And on designer t-shirts, equip the black print t-shirt. Which should be this one. And after you do so, go save this outfit to slot number 1. So make sure you save it to slot number 1. Then after you save this outfit to the first slot, you want to go on outfits and go down to heist coveralls. And equip any of the last four. Then after you do so, head to the telescope on the pier. And over here, you want to do the telescope glitch, so run by the telescope, and spam right on the d-pad, and you want to equip the outfit you just saved. And when you walk away, the gas mask should merge on, and now you want to go to the mask store. And 
And over here, you want to go on any of these menus and save this outfit to slot number one. So override the save. And after you do this, open up your pause menu and you want to go to online and go on to jobs, play jobs. Then go on to Rockstar Created and go on Versa and go on missions and start with the first one. And in this menu, just start a mission up. And you should load in with a gas mask on your outfit. However, if you don't, restart your game and try this again. You should also notice you have an invisible torso. And now you want to go to the ammunition store in the mission. Now in here, just go save the outfit in slot number 1. So override the save. And then once you do so, you want to quit the job using your phone. And once you load in, go back into an ammunition store. And go into the outfit section. Now, equip any outfit with a belt you want to merge onto this outfit. So if you want to, you can use any of these air racing suits. And it will merge the belts from these uh, onto your outfit. So I'd recommend going with a black one, of course. Uh, but you can equip any one you want to. Or if you want to, if you have the paramedic belt or gun belt, uh, just use one of those if you want to merge one of those uh, onto the outfit. Uh, but I'm going to be using one of the Diamond Casino Heist belts. Uh, but it's all up to you. Now, once you have the outfit with a belt you want to merge equipped, all you want to do is you want to make sure you have an earpiece for this next bit, which if you do not have, you can purchase from the gear section in the ammunition store. But you do not want to have it equipped, so uh, if you have to buy it, just make sure you unequip it before this next bit. So once you have it purchased, all you want to do is open up your pause menu and go to online jobs, and you want to go on to play jobs, and go down to Rockstar Creating and go on Versus, and start Crooked Cop. Now, once you load into this menu, you want to set a clothing to player owned and then invite anyone to start this up. Now, in this menu, you can down to owned outfit and scroll one to the right and you should notice a belt merges over onto this outfit and now you want to ready up. Then, once you load in, equip your earpiece using your interaction menu. And after you do so, go to the clothing store in the mission so you spawn closer when you quit the mission. Now once you're down here, make sure your earpiece is still equipped and then you want to quit the job using your phone. Now once you spawn in, you want to go into the clothing store and save the outfit. And before you go on to add the duffel bag, feel free to customise the outfit as much as you want to. Now to get the duffel bag, you want to either become a CEO or an MC President. And you will need a terabyte, so you want to request your terabyte and go over to it. Now once you buy a terabyte, you want to go inside and go into the computer in the middle. And once you're on this, all you want to do is go and climb jobs and start up the first one called Robbery in Progress. And I'll search for the heist. Um, once you find it, you want to go in the interior. And then back out, and you want to head over to wherever your heist is. So once you're out of bank, the robbery is taking place. All you want to do is take out the police and the robbers.
and then one of the robbers should drop the duffel bag so before you pick it up uh, make sure you have your outfit you made in the video equipped and then pick it up and you want to lose the cops and then once you have lost the cops you will need a flying vehicle for this next bit so uh, so you can use a helicopter plane or, or it's easiest with the oppressor mark too so if you have one uh, use that however if you do not own any flying vehicles uh, you can go to one of the places where the helicopters spawn and use one of those and now you want to head over to the golden circle and fly a decent height above and then jump off your flying vehicle and open your parachute immediately and you're aiming to land right on the golden circle If you do not land right on the golden circle it shouldn't matter too much and it should still work you just want to go into the golden circle and once you've done so you want to go to any ammunition store now over here go on parachutes and you want to go on parachute bags and equip the israel shoot bag And once you do this, equip it using your interaction menu and then go and fly a decent high above the mask store. And when I was doing this, I had to use one of these helicopters uh, because my oppressor mark 2 and I would have had to wait a few minutes to call it back. Uh, so I decided to use one of these and see if it still works. Uh, so once you have your flying vehicle, like a helicopter, or if you have your oppressor, that's even better. Uh, you want to fly a decent high above the mask store. And then you want to jump out your flying vehicle and then pull your parachute immediately and now you're aiming to land right in front of the mask store uh, so you can get on the menu before taking off your parachute so when you land you want to spam right on the d-pad uh, to get onto the menu and i wouldn't recommend using a helicopter as it did take my helmet off and if you don't know once you have the duffel bag on you cannot actually put a helmet back on as you cannot access any menus and by the way, if you do not get on the menu first try, all you need to do is retry the last bit, so get back on a flying vehicle and do it once more, but this time try get on the menu. And when you get on the menu, all you need to do is save the outfit. Now all you want to do is open up your interaction menu and equip the outfit you just saved. And it will have the duffel bag. But anyway, that should be the outfit fully complete. And that's going to be it for this video. So I hope you enjoyed. And I hope you liked the outfit. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you did find this helpful, I would appreciate it if you could leave a like. It's all up to you. And anyway, have an amazing day or night. And I will see you all in the next one.